Domestic violence or sexual abuse can happen to anyone, and every day, millions of men and women live through a domestic situation. But there are resources one can turn to nationally and here locally. Markeisha Jackson sat down with First Step Incorporated to discuss all the ways they help people escape violent situations, and she joins us now with more. Markeisha. Lauren, for decades now, First Step Incorporated has been providing free services to anyone experiencing domestic violence, and they say it's a need now more than ever. On average, nearly 20 people a minute are physically abused by a partner, and it's abuse that could affect any of us. Domestic violence doesn't just happen in a certain part of the year, it happens all the time, and we always need to be aware and educated. Mackenzie Splon, an outreach case manager at First Step Incorporated, says talking about domestic violence is a tough conversation, but it's a reality First Step wants more people to talk about in hopes of removing the taboo and help individuals get out of these situations before it's too late. So we offer both outreach um, and shelter so we have a 24-hour emergency safe house where anyone leaving an abusive situation can go stay um, and just get out of the danger that they're in. Then we also offer counseling, case management, um, legal advocacy. Services that can help a domestic violence victim get things like protective orders in place so they can begin to find a safe place to call home, which is what Splon calls the first step. So it's really important that people realize that they're not alone because a lot of the times when they're leaving an abusive situation, they've been so isolated for so long um, that they don't really have a support system anymore. The nonprofit also wants to remind everyone to pay close attention to those around them and look out for signs of domestic abuse. Aside from physical signs, periods of isolation from family and friends and signs of depression could all be behavior pointing towards domestic violence. It chooses anyone. It's not just something that only affects women. Um, it affects men, LGBTQ. It affects absolutely everyone. So. Um, you know, no matter your race, religion, color, gender, anything at all, domestic violence is there um, and it's going to affect everyone. And the donations, volunteers, and support from this community is what Splon says will help First Step continue to be here to help anyone going through this kind of abuse. And if you or someone you know may be going through an abusive situation, you can call First Step at 1-800-658-2683. They are there to help 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Yeah, very important work that they do, Markeisha, for sure. And I know we'll have that number again for you on Texoma's homepage.com. Thanks so much.